Yes, and now that's interesting. Why why didn't um, Officer Matthews help you with the inmate when she was struggling in medical? At, and that was about um, 13, 30 hours. Can't tell you why he didn't, um, he didn't start to help me. Can't tell you why. Did you ask him to help no, you? No, I did not. Okay. But you indicated um, on the stand, you said that you needed, you have, you need two officers. We one don't on necessarily one need two officers. When a person is, for instance, that <coughs> incident was a little different because we were just taking her out of medical. Now, mind you, I'm a big guy. Jack Matthews is not exactly a small guy. It's a little hard to get two of us between those little doorways and that little tiny hallway. So it's kind of like you do what you got to do to get the job done, so to speak, in that tight area. Okay. Now, Matthews didn't help you with the inmate as you're walking the inmate into 136 either. He's walking behind you. Right. He didn't catch up? No. Okay. Um, so the two-officer rule is really not a rule. It's just as it's being perceived, correct? Right. It's just kind of common practice. All right. And does, does somebody have to say, hey, can you help me? Or does usually an officer just come and, and assist? Normally an officer would just come in and assist. It, it all depends on the situation. All right. Um, 